here's how I want you to approach this. So the very first launch you go through with your app is going to be your pilot launch. And this is where you are essentially validating what is technically a theory up to that point that a certain set of features will solve a problem that you have identified. Now, no matter how certain you are that your app is going to solve the problem, it is still technically a theory because you haven't put it to practice yet. So your pilot launch, the, the very first launch you'll go through, is to validate that. You are just making sure that the product you've come up with can solve the problem you've identified in the way that you've envisioned. Now, from there, you're gonna go into your beta launch. Now, your beta launch is a little bit different. This is where your test users can come on board the app and consistently use it in real life applications to solve that problem on a recurring basis. So your pilot launch is just for the product's validation, but you're not, you're not necessarily rolling it out to your users, but your beta testing is where you do have a group of users come on board and take it and run with it and make sure that the product is adoptable. Now from there, you're going to go into what I just like to refer to as the rollout stage. And I call it rollout because it's kind of like, you know, you're going from beta testing where, okay, you, you have confirmed that the product is adoptable. And now you're just trying to kind of work out the kinks, release it to your wider market and just make it better. You're looking at user retention, usage, and all these things, just trying to kind of hone in on that product. And from there, you're going to enter the scale phase. And this is where, you know, your, your product has been refined enough to where it's, it's working, it's working consistently. You are retaining your users. The, the usage is high and consistent. And now you're just trying to make it even better, roll it out to more people, maybe add on different, um, feature sets that would appeal to different segments. You are just uh, simply put, you are scaling the product. So if you take the app idea you have now and think of all the features that you have envisioned it having, you need to place all those different features into those different stages and kind of put them where they would be most applicable based on the different goals of each of those stages.